guys. guys, if you're new to this channel, make sure you subscribe right down below so you don't miss out on any of our new vlogs, any mm -hmm. of our DK adventures. And if you're not new to this channel, welcome back to our channel and join us on today's video. In today's video, we're going to be showing you guys what a $70 suite in a five-star luxury hotel looks like in Bangkok versus what a $200 suite in a five-star luxury hotel looks like in Las Vegas. Oh yeah, and for a $70 suite in Bangkok, we chose the one bedroom suite at Le Meridien Golf Resort and Spa. And it's actually right next to the Savarna Bomi Airport. So if you gotta fly the next day, you will come here, you relax, and you go. And if you're wondering why aren't we comparing this $70 suite to a $70 suite in Las Vegas, it's because it's basically impossible to find a $70 suite in a five star luxury hotel. Impossible. <laughs> <laughs> I think $200 is probably the cheapest you're gonna find. To kickstart the video. <laughs> We're gonna show you where the magic happens. Baby, where does the magic happen? We're going straight into the bedroom, baby. Let's go. Oh, you ready for the room tour? All right. <laughs> first things first, here's your chilling bedroom area, right? So this is a sofa. You've got like a table space area. You can't move this, it's very heavy. At least I can. Yeah, you can have a coffee, you can do some work, you can lay down. It's actually really comfortable. We have not one remote, but two remotes. If you love to watch TV and you and your partner are here, you can argue over which movie to watch and you can just keep switching it. Tick, 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 and then see who wins. We've got a huge king size bed. I was like, oh wow. Wow, this bed is so comfortable. <gasps> These pillows are definitely some of the most comfortable pillows I've ever been able to lay my head on. So tonight's sleep is gonna be incredible. That is if we get any sleep because we're off to Vegas. <laughs> I actually like that this is quite big. There's not a lot of space to add anything, but you can always make space. You know, you can move the lamp around. You can move the radio. This is a radio. Dante likes to write all of his things on the phone. I love to write on the notepads that the hotels provide you of. On the bedside cabinet, they actually provide you with a little charge kit. How cute is that? You can charge your phone. You can charge your iPad 3, maybe. I'm not sure. It's the old app iPads. You've got this charger. That's really, really lovely. I love that. But you've also got plug sockets right here and also on the workspace. So let me show you the workspace area. <laughs> this chair is so comfy. My butt literally just sinks into this chair. You've got a really large working space area. So honestly, if we had a second chair, we could be working on here together. You've got plug sockets, USB to TV. I'm not sure if you can charge your phone here, but you can connect your phone to the TV. They also provide you with a documents box and they provide you with some envelopes in case you need them, even some paper to write on. And then I'm guessing you put the paper in your envelopes and send it out. Obviously Dante and I are only staying here for a night, so we don't need all the drawer space, but if you're staying here for a while and you need a lot of space you've got it all one drawer two and a big one three Ta -da. I rate this workspace really highly in the bedroom they give you two complimentary waters and the reason I say bedroom is because as we go and show you the rest of the suite you'll probably see some more complimentary water there's also a few brochures in case you need more information about the hotel and its services and you got the menu in case you want in room dining that is the bedroom tour so now Dante's gonna take you into the balcony <laughs> So Gaudi showed you the room tour, now I'm going to show you what the balcony looks like and then we're going to bring you around the rest of this lovely suite. Let's go. So you've got a nice little chilling area here, big enough for two to three people. You can relax, lay down, you've got a table here and a smoking pot, but we don't smoke. Don't forget the views. Wow. I've never had views looking over a golf court before, so this is very new to me and it just looks amazing. You want to walk through. Now I'm in the living room side of the balcony. You got a seating area right here, and then you got a sofa as well. So this and is literally big me. enough for everyone. And then you got my baby over there. I just showed you guys this massive balcony. Now we're gonna take you into the living room. And yes, that's right. This suite has a living room, which is insane. Let's go. <laughs> this living room area is very spacious. You got beautiful artwork, a very big sofa that you can just spread your legs along. And I'm six foot two, so you can see how. <laughs> So you can see how big the sofa is. I really like this carpet as well. It just adds that homely vibe to this suite. And some suites, they don't have this type of stuff, so you don't get that vibe, but I really like this. And swinging around from the sofa area, you've got the entertainment where you've got the TV, there's a little sound system down here where you can plug in an aux lead or your iPhone or anything like that and listen to some music. And then we've got another seating area. This suite is literally littered with seating areas, so you're gonna be spoiled for choice. This is Kali's favorite. It's just unique and a bit of her. This is my favorite over here. This is like 
a very, you know, how do you say it, like a bossy chair. You're sitting there like, mmm. And I love how the colour matches the carpet as well and it also matches the pillows so they've done really well with matching it to that as well. It, like The colour scheme in here is really really nice and it gives it that homey vibe again. Next to this amazing seating area you've got the refreshments area. In this area you've got tea, coffee, water, like four different types of glasses. There's actually quite a few selections of teas and coffee so that's really nice. Down here we've got a mini fridge. Ooh. Check that out. Yeah, we ballin' baby. You know how we do, we got the juice. In the drawers, we got some snacks. These ones are empty, it's just extra storage space. But then you got a kettle. So far we've shown you 50% of the suite, now it's time to show you the other 50%. Follow me, come into the walk-in closet. Right into the walk-in wardrobe. This is insane, there's a walk-in wardrobe inside the suite. Let me show you. So right here, we've got two sliding doors. You can see we already made use of this space. We put our luggage there. It comes with our iron, iron boards, and the flash torch. You've got hanger space here, and some more space on top if you want to put some more luggage. You could probably fit a carry-on on there. Slide it over. In this area, you've got all the hangers. You've got some brushes for your shoes, laundry bag, slippers, and a shoe horn. This is just another nice space to put your clothes and store all your stuff. You also got some storage area up here as well. You have the safe area. You also got loads of drawers for storage and little cubby holes built into the wall, which is really cool. And what makes the space even bigger is the big mirror there and the big mirror there. So it just literally opens up the space even more. Now you guys are probably wondering what's behind this door. So let me show you one of my favorite parts of this suite. Da -da -da -da. Let's go into this beautiful big bathroom. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. I want to just jump in. Why didn't we have the water ready? Okay, I can't. <laughs> Let me not get too excited. First things first, you got this really, really large sink area. Dante actually brought this up to me when we first got in. I can sit here and do my makeup. Not really like I do makeup, but if you do makeup, we can sit here. You know, you've got the close mirror, or you've got a big mirror and a bit of cha-la-la-la, -la -la, -la, la You've got more complimentary water, like I mentioned earlier. You're gonna see it around the suite. You've got face towels. This part, I was like, wow, that just looks fancy. Like, you come in and I don't know what brand this is. I just see a lot of words and it looks really fancy, like peppermint shampoo. And look, vitamin B5 body moisture. Like, I'm, I'm moisturizing my body with B5. And actually, if you need more light, guess what? You can open these curtains. And not only does it allow more light, but if you want to go straight into the bedroom, you just open the door and ta-da! Now I've already given you a bedroom tour, so let's go back into the toilet. I didn't say let's go into the toilet, so here I am. You know, if you want your privacy, you can just close the door. And you won't smell me. This toilet seat is actually super comfortable. And as most of you know, this is one of the things that Dante and I look for when we're booking a hotel. We really love something you can wash yourself with after peeing or even before or whenever in the day. Right next to the toilet is actually the shower. And the shower is huge. You could honestly have like, one, two, honestly, you could have like six people in here. I, don't, I honestly don't know who would shower with six people, but you have so much space. Like, ha, who, hey. Let's test out the water fresh. It's good. Yeah. Shall we test out the upper shower head? That one's strong. And then they give you some more amenities over there as well. So if you run out over the ones that they gave you next to the sink, you've got some more in here. Okay. All right, let's continue the bathroom tour. Over here, you've got a relaxing area. I've never relaxed in a bathroom like that, but I guess if you just want to relax in a bathroom, then you can't. Can we just take a minute to appreciate how big this bathtub is? I'm gonna have a bath here tonight. Not sleeping, I'm staying right here. Are you joining me, baby? I'm joining you. And this, I really love. Look at these towels. They're so big. Oh my God, they're as big as my whole body. What? Another thing you'll find in a bathroom is two bathrobes. These are so comfortable. Probably some of the most comfortable <laughs> bathrobes we've had. They're amazing. Like, you know, bathrobes can be quite rough in your skin sometimes, mm -hmm. but you still wear it anyway. Nothing to do with these. These are soft, baby. I'm probably gonna sleep in these. Mm -hmm. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> I didn't show you guys the amenities that come over here. They give you two dental kits. They give you shaving kit. They give you a comb. I love these. I'm probably gonna pack this away with me. And I saw this earlier and I got super excited, but they give you like a nail file and I always lose mine. So 
I'm gonna be using this one because my nails always break. I don't know why. And if you want more stuff, you can actually just call them and you can pick up anything on this list and ask for it. And if you need to dry your hair, they also got a hair dryer for you right in here. That pretty much sums up our $70 sweet tour. You know what? Sweet and sweet rhymes because this sweet is pretty sweet. <laughs> But as well as getting a beautiful suite, the hotel actually comes with an infinity pool, a fitness center, kids club, an Italian restaurant, and many more things that I don't even think and I know about. And the golf course. I thought you told them. You showed them the balcony. <laughs> and the golf course that you can use for additional charge. Overall, this is a really amazing five-star luxurious hotel in my opinion. Would and you this, come here again? I would definitely come here. I was telling Dante, if you deep it, um, for us obviously we, we speak in pounds, so it's 50 pounds a night for us. Mm -hmm. If you multiply 50 times 30 it's 1,500 so if I was staying here a month I'd be paying 1,500 I'd be living in a beautiful suite I would do that and some of my friends are paying 1,500 for their little apartments in London and uh, in America as well and they're not getting much so let us know down below in the comments how much you pay for your accommodation and what do you get for your accommodation and if you had the opportunity would you live here for 30 days also if you don't want to live here for 30 days let us know would you spend the night here but that's all from this sweet tour we're gonna go to Vegas now and see you over there let's go <laughs> we made it to Vegas baby are you happy with Vegas I'm so happy with Vegas you see the vibes right now come on I can't put my elbows up like that. <laughs> <laughs> For our Vegas day, we chose to stay at the Palazzo in the Venetian and we chose to stay in their luxury king suite. It's only $200 a night. However, you can get upgraded for only $50 and get a view and be on one of their top floors. So we actually chose that option. We chose to pay an extra $50, mm -hmm. be on the 45th floor so we can show you the best views and the best this room has to and offer. And we're looking right over the strip. Right over the strip. But Prime the room views. doesn't change. So if you don't want to pay the extra $50, you can just stay in the same room just mm -hmm. with no view. But enough talking, I know you don't want to hear my voice no more, so Dante's going to show you around the room and show you what we got! Welcome to Dante's room tours, follow me. <laughs> to start off this room tour, we're not going to start with the bedroom, we're not going to start with the front room, we're going to start with the source, we're going to start with the view. Let me take you over to this control system right here. You have the option to press share, drapery or all. So I'm going to press all and you click open. This view is absolutely insane. You've got views of the whole Las Vegas Strip. You can see over the mountains. Do you guys want to see what it's like at nighttime? Wow. This is incredible. This is their workspace that they have to offer. It's pretty sophisticated if I have to say so myself. You've got a very nice lamp right here. You've got the phone. Make some business calls, order room service, you know what to do. And you actually got two plug sockets here, two American ones, and then you got two USB ones. One high voltage, one low voltage. And then you got some drawer space as well. I wish I could just pack you up in there. It'd be nice. It'd be nice. Cloudy and I could work close together, but it'd be a bit, you know, a bit tight. I feel like it's just for one person. But it's pretty cool. Now let me show you the rest of the room. So I'm actually going to call this their front room area because you've got a little divider right here that separates the bedroom from the front room. Let me show you <coughs> their beautiful couch. Gaudi and I were sitting on this earlier and you can literally spread two people on here. Easy peasy. Have a great view of the TV over there and you've got a beautiful view so you can just reminisce, think about business and just look at the big montañas. <laughs> Wow! You know, they got some cool little features. You got a nice central table right here, another side table next to the sofa, and some comfortable pillows. So, compared to the suite in Bangkok, this actually has the same amount of seating space because you got a desk area, you got a little seating space here with two chairs, and then you got a big sofa area. Down here, underneath the TV, you got a fully stocked mini fridge. Yeah, fully stocked. I'm talking everything. Everything you can ever dream of. That's something that the other suite didn't have to offer, so that's pretty impressive if you guys love your mini fridges. Now let me take you where the magic happens. Who? Who? Bed test! Oh god. Who? 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 That was actually pretty dope. Oh my you guys see me sinking, I'm still sinking. I'm still sinking. Oh my goodness, this pillow is amazing. Cody, I'm still sinking. Why you look so crooked? <laughs> Yo! I'm still sinking. 
Whoa, this bed is insane. I love the features it has. It has two curtains next to it that aren't actually operational. It's more for some decor purposes. It's got a wooden backboard and then you got a cool, you know, a little board here. <laughs> and then you got two mirrors as well. Night lamps. Next to this side of the bed, you got big drawers and the Holy Bible. Good amount of drawer space if you're here for a week or so and you need to put your clothes away. Next to this bedside cabinet, oh. We have an alarm clock and in the alarm clock you got two chargers, one high voltage, one low voltage. You also got the master switch, you can control all the draperies so if you want to wake up in the morning, open the lights, open the curtains, bloop, bloop, just like that. And you can turn off the reading lamps, right, boop, 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 boop. And if you're not ready to go to bed yet, you do have a chair placed right here in a, you know, in a cool spot and you can just sit and watch your big TV right here. Underneath the TV, you've got another big drawer space. This is very, very generous with its space, I have to say so. So you've got six drawers together, very large, got a lot of depth as well. A lot of depth. Usually you don't get that much drawer space. You've got some next to the bedside cabinet and then a big unit right here, so that's very generous. In Vegas, you don't get many things complimentary, but in this suite, you get a complimentary hygiene set, Venetian Clean. In the hygiene set, you get two masks, well, actually three masks, wow. You get two sanitizing wipes and some Germex. Germex. <laughs> it's like an advert. <laughs> you also have the guest guide where you have in-room dining and you have the clean introduction, casino games, ooh, resort updates as well. So all the information you need and all the food you need is right in this book. In the bedroom area, they have a nice little wardrobe section. Open it, the light turns on automatically. You got a place to put your luggage. You also got a few hangers. Where Dante hanged up his mask. Yeah. <laughs> you got iron board and iron laundry service on the left. And then you got a nice space up here to put, Gaudi's put a bag where you can put shoes, anything you want like that. And then you got an interesting size safe right here as well, which is pretty cool. You got security. Follow me. And this is where Gaudi takes over. Hello! It's time to show you this amazing bathroom. Ready? Ta-da! Let's take in a little bathroom tour. As you come in, you've got two sinks. You've got this huge sink area, so Dante and I don't even bother each other. But somehow, I always just love to be in a space regardless. They give you some complimentary soap. We haven't opened this, as you can see. We want to keep it nice and clean for you. They give you complimentary face towels, lotion. Dante and I always have dry legs. This is really good. <laughs> I overall really love this design. It's just so, like, vintage but like in a very modern way so I don't know I really love it. Then you've got a bath, you've got obviously your towels, the bath is pretty big. I don't know if it would fit two people, you kind of have to squeeze in there but it's definitely big enough for one person or for Dante. But right next to it you've also got a really huge shower. They give you some complimentary body wash, conditioner and shampoo. It looks very big, very nice, very clean. That's one thing I really love about this suite. It feels and looks amazingly clean. This is one of my favorite part as well. I actually filmed a TikTok here because it's just so cute. You can do your makeup right here. You've got an amenities box. Comes with the sewing kit. And I love this one. It just feels super fancy because it's like all wrapped up in like a plastic box. If you've already seen some of our videos, you know that I get excited over the smallest things. <laughs> then we've got a nail section, I guess a nail file and a... This part is to clean up the dirt, I'm guessing. We've got a shower cap with a hair tie. Love that. Sometimes they only give you a shower cap and then you got no hair tie. Sometimes I lose all of my hair ties and I just really wish the suite or the hotel came with a hair tie. Last but not least, you get some cotton pads and earbuds. As you can see, as well as having a makeup area here, they also have that in the other suite. So right now you've got kind of the same things for both. You've also got hair dryer. You can add some light here as well. That's super cool. This section is honestly one of my favorites. We feel like a little princess. You know what, as a kid, you always wish to have like a section like this. In here is the toilet. I actually really like how you can just lock yourself away in the toilet within the bathroom because I can be brushing my teeth or doing my bath or taking a shower and that they can be doing in there, doing his own thing. So it's like you still get privacy in a privacy place. Does that make sense? All right, let me show you the toilet. It's actually really spacious. You get two really big toilet paper rolls. And Dante really wants me to mention that they're really soft. So I'm guessing he really likes the soft toilet paper roll so it doesn't irritate him. They're very premium luxury. <laughs> they're very premium luxury. And the toilet is very comfy as well. It's always a bonus to sit on a toilet comfy. Oh no, comfy toilet. <laughs> I'm leaving now. <laughs> I meant to say a comfy 
Excellent. I've got one more thing to show you in the bathroom and then my bathroom tour ends. However, this thing is super cool. We've got a TV in our bathroom. Like that is so cool. I could just take a bath and watch the TV at the same time. Even brush my teeth and watch the TV. Do anything and watch the TV except for be in a toilet. But that's fine. I just find this really, really cool. You know, you don't get a TV in your bathroom every day. Overall, I really love this bathroom. It's just cute and petite. It makes me feel like a princess. But comparing this bathroom to the one in Bangkok, the other one is obviously a lot bigger, but they've got some of the same stuff, like obviously the, the makeup area, the hair dryer, some of the amenities. The other one offers more amenities. I would honestly rate both bathrooms a 10 out of 10. They're both beautiful in their own way. The other one just a lot more spacious. This is a suite tour done, but as well as having a wonderful suite, they obviously have three pools many restaurants we are in Las Vegas so they got two casinos ching, ching, ching. <laughs> you can like never get bored here you're basically in a mall and as you can see this suite tour went by a lot quicker than the one in Bangkok and that's because this suite is 66 meters squared and the one in Bangkok is hundred and three meters mm -hmm. squared so that's like what like a whole 40, 40. meter squeeter boom mm, meters. <laughs> that's, that's how big it is it's, it's a just... whole 40 meter squeeters <laughs> but this hotel in Las Vegas is really cool because they only offer suites and when I found that out, I was like, what? What do you mean you only have sweets? <laughs> what? That's insane. But that's all from us. If you love this video and you would like to see more content like this from us, make sure you comment right down below. Let us know. And let us know if you're going to be staying at one of these hotels. And if you guys are interested in staying at these hotels, we're going to link them down below in the description so you guys can easily find them. And this is where I go. <laughs> I'm gonna show you the bathroom. I can't wait to show you the bathroom because you already know I'm a bathroom queen and I love the bathroom. <laughs> How many times is she gonna say bathroom? <laughs> it's my turn to show off the toilet. The toilet. Okay. <laughs> okay, ready? <laughs> Don't make sure you miss me. is where the towels are like. You get a whole, <laughs> I don't know, I just get a whole artsy thing. For our Vegas suite, we chose the Panician at... <laughs> Look. <laughs> you didn't get out here? Sweet, we chose... Okay. <laughs> I got it. For our suite in Vegas, we chose the Palazzo at the Luxury King. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Palazzo at the Venetian. <laughs> But here, you get a con 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 complimentary. We're gonna link them down below in the description so you guys don't have to. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you look drunk? <laughs> we made it to Vegas and Nancy's looking drunk, although we haven't even drunk. <laughs> Why are you laughing so much? Oh my god. <laughs> we love you guys. Bye.